Hello, and welcome back to Let's Play Underrail Expedition with me, Bring It Don. And we are going to uh, keep exploring. Well, specifically, we're looking for the faceless that are rumored to be to the west of Foundry. Rat hounds. Well, I consider that a job well done. Alright, there's a way south and I guess a way north. Hmm. Let's go north because we haven't explored that yet. But I have revealed it on the map, so I may as well take care of it. If it's just more rat hounds to look forward to, then no problem. So we climb down, and there are some doors. Uh-oh. Hecate? Is it Hecate? Hecate Research Outpost? Warning. Electrical circuit damage detected in lower levels. Certain phases might be disabled. Electrical oscillations detected. Manual full reset recommended. Toggle gate. Alright, um... Sounds like it's gonna be a quest area. Hecate Research. Oh, here we go. Let's see what uh, lies in wait. I mean, rat hounds were outside the facility, so it shouldn't be too bad, right? Greater coil spider. Oh, that sounds terrifying. Can I hurt you? Barely. Oh, where'd he go? Oh, maybe he turned invi- oh, can he turn invisible? Oh, that charges him. They do a lot of damage. Okay, I don't think I want to be here yet. I don't feel comfortable being here. Alright. We'll save this for later. I'm sure we have to come back here for something. Um, I'll mark it on the map. I'm here to look for Faceless, not get sucked in. You know what? I'm going to close the gate, too. Don't want those guys getting out. Yeah, not interested in that. I will mark it on the map real quick. Uh, Hecate Research Facility. Uh... Needs exploring. Alright. 
Yeah, my goal is to find a faceless. I'm not worried about the Hecate research facility. Or those spiders for right now, anyway. Let's not uh, worry about that. Alright, we'll take the South Passage. So this is to the east of Foundry, so we're not going to be finding the, the faces we're looking for. There are dogs here, which tells me... Well, it could just be a pack of dogs, but most likely they're going to be with a group of... Lunatics, right? I got my last mark. Well, shoot, I'm gonna take care of these guys like I was hoping. <laughs> Alright, another southern passage. A train log and a morphine shot. And we leveled up. I thought I had two to go, but I'll take it. Skills. Here I'm going to keep stacking up Iron Grip so I can get more damage out of it. And then here... Alright, well I'm excited. Level 17. Only 13 levels left in the game. No more North Passage. I guess since we're here we could go East. Uh, I kind of want to get back this way and go west. I've taken that north passage. So let's go back. So again, I'm looking. I want to find the faceless, and then we can explore. I want to take care of the goal. The uh, that quest objective. Old research lab now used for other purposes. It's an interesting description, and I don't know what it means yet. Alright, west we go. Booze bottle, 2 XP. A track. What was that? Praetorian Enforcer. Oh, it must be near Core City then. Right, because not the Praetorians, one of the factions there. The Might be worth going south just to connect up that area. Uh, so that would give me a western and a northern passage, but I don't know how to even get up here. I have to do it from up here. Alright, so west passage, north passage. Does it say the Praetorians are here? No. Alright, we'll go south. 
Let's do it up this way. At some point, I need to go back and take uh, take the fight to that giant crawler down in that cave system. All the way down here. Rat hounds. Yeah, I remember when you guys used to mean something. But no longer. For man has reconquered the, uh, the underrail. Well, in areas with rat hounds, anyway. The train log. Another fancy lighter. Alright, so there is a western passage. I kind of want to keep going south, but where does this take me? It probably takes me to a different area, right? Probably ends up connecting to that because it has a northern passage. Let's see, south tracks, passage, and an eastern passage. Alright. Let's see if this connects up to this other area. This one, then that probably, yeah, it'll connect to that. Uh-oh. Should have been a little more careful. Well, I might be okay here. We'll do is we'll tase him, then we'll kill him. <laughs> of course he resisted, and then we're gonna move as close as we can. Of course. Gunner stays right there, he's dead next turn. Just like that. Alright, that's your last turn, buddy. <sighs> or not. There we go. I do like that, uh, that ice shield he casts. I don't know what it's called. I say look here, right? Just says invoking cryokinesis, um, kneecap shot, burst. See, there's no highlighted name. All it says is cryokinesis. I don't see anything about a shield. Oh, what was uh, that recipe? Extract humor. It'll take away all your funny, mister. Oh, I keep doing that. I keep tabbing out of my darn game. More bubble gum. Under pie and some capsules. I heal up one more time. Also, I did not see that explosive barrel. Should have used that.
Alright, Southern Passage should take me to that, right? And then we'll come back up and we'll go west. Yep. Everything's coming together. Just as the prophecies foretold. Old abandoned biocore facility. No way for me to get inside. So I'm sure that door will open later. Biocore facility uh, needs. Come on now. Alright. Well, I like finding dead ends because it means that, uh,. I can go explore other directions. So I could go back to the tracks here. Let's go down. Yeah, we haven't explored this area yet. So let's take the southern tracks passage. So this is probably where, because that's west of Foundry, that eastern passage will probably take us to the faceless. So we'll deal with that in due time. Are there going to be people here? I see blood. Iron heads. I'm afraid of what's around the corner. Um, as well I should be. So I'll just flashbang him, and then I should be able to kill him without them, uh... Got an adrenaline shot, then we can kill this guy. They're not this guy. Can I tase him? No. I can't move beside him and yell. <laughs> can I wish to charge up my spear all the way then? And a smasher. Alright, I might be in a little bit of trouble. <laughs> Happens to me quite a bit. Not as worried about the Smasher, because I can block most of his damage. The Grenader, he's not a threat once I get close. Alright, let's see if I can kill him. Well, I can definitely kill him. I can tase this guy. For next turn. Yeah, I blocked most of his damage. Oh boy. This keep coming. I like Morpheus gonna save me here. I think I'm just dead here. Dead the next turn. Oh wow, another heavy gunner. Oh, this place is nasty. It's a lot of enemies. Um, Alright, I don't think that I'm going to... Ugh, do this yet. I'm going to leave it saying it needs exploring. Uh... 
large iron head gang. I'm gonna go back, we're gonna go that to that eastern passage, see if we can't just go ahead and find the faceless, take care of that. And then we can deal with the uh this iron heads another time. So I'm going to minimize my game again real quick. So I lost track of the time. Full of traps. I'm gonna try to disable it. I don't think that I can. <laughs> All right, yeah, that's a sign that I shouldn't bother. Oh, I gotta try. <laughs> How'd the trap move? How'd... I understand failing. I was like, but there's no way that if I fail this, it's gonna get me. <laughs> but it did. I, f I messed up so bad, I guess when I was trying to disable it, I just threw my foot into it. Because <laughs> my guy has, uh... No reason to be messing around with traps. <laughs> so my thought was... Oh, I didn't mark this northern passage. So the west of Foundry, this is everything west of Foundry, unless it's even further west. Okay, um... Wait, did I not explore this area? I found your, yeah, we've done that. Okay, that's done. That has an east passage. I guess we can go try and pick a fight with those Ironheads again. Uh, if we fail, I'll we'll probably have to call an episode. So let's charge up my spear a little more, and then we'll go... The only problem is there's not like a good spot to stand in there. It's like you're around the corner and you're out in the open. I didn't see a good position for my uh, character to stand and force them to me. I could do it around the corner, but they have an angle. If, I'm, if I stay around the side of the sheet metal that they have up as a wall, I should probably just go and charge this up all the way as well. It'll protect me from an extra shot or two. Or not, because those heavy gunners are hitting pretty hard. It's like 72 damage. I can stand over here and force them to me, but they can stand like way back here, so they won't be in range. Let's see if there's anything on the other side. It's just a bunch of empty space. Oh, a dead man. Nothing on him. Okay. At least it wasn't an explosive trap. Because that would have brought them all running to me. I need to be aggressive, but then there's heavy gunners in the back. I guess if I fought down here... It forced... It would buy me some time because the heavy gunners would have to come to me. The rest of them I could maybe kill before they got here. Hmm. Oh, no. Had to approach this with some, uh... Some grace. Hello. Oh wow, they go. Well, they go to my shield. <laughs> All right, then we just go hide around the corner and call it a day. I guess I could run all the way back to the entrance and then do the uh, the cheese tactics.
Ah. All right. Well, I took out one of them. I have to start running away. If there's more traps down here, there's a very good chance I'm going to run into more traps during my great escape. This is not a good uh, bottleneck. This one's too just too wide. It'd be cool if sandbags had like a cover mechanic. If I stood behind them, it's like a reduced chance of getting hit. Oh. Actually, well, I should probably I should attack first, then flashbang. I probably won't be able to though. But I can yell and I can tase the this guy. So the smasher should be able to get to me. Oh, oh he moved. Never mind. He can get to me. <laughs> Ignore what I was saying. Okay, and I could flashbang, but I'd rather kill this guy. Well, that was easy. You know what? We're going to be heading this way, because I kind of just want to leave before the heavy gunners get here so I can reset. Yeah, alright. So my goal is to kill the bomber and then just keep moving. Can I just reach you? Sure as crap can. Alright, time to boogie woogie. Leave me alone! Oh, they cannot move very far at all. Alright, that's pretty awesome. And, oh, and I'm in the dark, so that, that reduces their chance to hit and stuff. Alright, I got this figured out. Bring it, Don's got it. Alright, so I think there's only the three left, right? The two heavy gunners and the, uh, the regular gunner, if I'm not mistaken. Let's bring some of these Mark IIs. Where's the uh, thing again? There we go. Alright, uh, let's put two more grenades just to be safe. Oops. Why would you not just stack on top of that? Oh, those are Mark 3s. Okay, that's why. Uh, we don't need to use those yet. It's a barely discernible change in color. All right, in we go. My biggest concern with these range fights is having sprint up. Yeah, these guys have no chance if they can't hit me in the dark. Well, I can make it to this guy. I can probably kill him in one turn. Yeah. I'm gonna yell at you and turn up the shield. The next turn, I'm going to get you. This should be the one guy left, right? Awesome, he's not going to run away. <laughs> oh, you messed up, big guy. Oh, we're actually out of combat? I swear there's another heavy gunner in there. I mean, for, well, for all I know, there's to be a ton more enemies. Oh, 
Uh, that metal armor is actually pretty awful. It's not worth... It's worth barely more than the helmet. Or the helmet's just worth a lot. I suppose it could be either or. Also burning through batteries pretty quickly. Let's quick save, because I don't know when I'm going to uh, aggro that other gunner. Alright, there's the encumbrance. Probably don't need those. Oh, it's cheapest. That's not worth a whole lot. You're not worth a whole lot. Another flashbang. Thank goodness. I do need to put some points into chemistry so I can do my own flashbangs. So three or four dead here. There it is. Actually, you know what? I want to keep my my helmets. So I have plenty of guns back at the. Uh, well, you know, I'm pretty encumbered. All right, let's just get rid of the. Uh, Big guns. Twenty-eight, thirty-six. I'll do for now. I'll probably make some runs here uh, to foundry and everything. I swear, there's another heavy gunner. We're not done yet, so. Let's see what's down here. An adrenaline shot. Always a welcome sight. Are right, you guys ready to get frisky? Grenade, punks. Just we'll tase this guy. They got one shot off. I love days. All right. Next turn, he should be dead no matter what. I'm not super worried about the Sonic, especially since he's only using neural overload on me. What's up, buddy? Just you and me now. You just didn't have what it takes. Canned mushrooms. Oh yeah, I should have eaten some food to reduce mechanical damage taken. Bloody mobile computer. It's a mobile computer covered in dried blood. The model name reads MBF440S. But the brand it's but the brand itself is not familiar to you. Perhaps it was manufactured in North Underru. I can activate it. I guess that's what we'll do next time, because I don't know what it's for. Hey, we finally burnt all of our Mark 1 uh, frag grenades. 
All right, I'm gonna call the episode here. Uh, off camera, I'm gonna run all of the stuff I found here to another location. Or to, uh... I guess Foundry would be the fastest. Hopefully there's no enemies that respawned in here. And then, uh, next episode, we might activate that mobile computer. I'm still looking for the darn faceless. I've gone... West. I, mean, I guess we go north here, so maybe it's more northwest. But I feel like if we're getting to Core City territory, because Core, Core City was also invaded by Faceless, right? I don't know. I don't know what's going on. But anyway, calling it here. Uh, thanks for watching. Hope to see you guys in the next episode.